That was close. Too close. We brought that trouble on ourselves. By we, you mean me. The one me who went and shot him. It seemed like he deserved shoot. I'm sure he did. But I've been thinking, ain't it about time you stop being the man making them decisions? I'm trying. Are you? I think so. You gotta find some place to lay low. Keep quiet. <sighs> Maybe Dutch was right. Maybe we should've just gone to Tahiti. Is that it with you? Tahiti or killing? Come on, John. Please, try. Try what? We gotta live somewhere for more than just a few weeks. Okay. Let's see what we can find in... in Strawberry. What do you know about Strawberry? I know they like good, honest, hard-working so they came... a lot more than angry killers. So make yourself good and honest. I'm what's always what's honest. making me worried Maybe is... Not always good, but I'm always honest. Mikey and Dutch are still alive. My whole life I've been surrounded by fools with moral codes. Here's the moral code. Look out for folks. Stop trying to act like some hero in a book. What do you know about heroes and books? My reading's getting pretty good. Well, read different books then. The books is Jack's. Oh, shit. And, well, maybe he's doing most of the reading, but still. You're a bad influence. I love how they have boy. you play John. Boy. Because he was the main character in the last one, what right? I said you're a bad influence on your mother. Which books? Which books was that? You know, that dime novel or Boy Calloway and the Men from the Moon or whatever it was. I'll do my best to find better reading material, Bob. That what you like, then? Western tales? Boy. What's that, sir? Do you enjoy tales of the Wild West? Not so much. Anymore. I've been reading about knights. You know, of the round table. The king. What's his name? There's King Arthur. Ah. Uh. And there's Sir Lancelot. And the Lady Guinevere. And a whole lot of others. Those names. King Arthur. I kind of like them. You know what? So do I. Oh my gosh, bro. I got a good feeling about this place. Been a long time. Now, game, devs, I beg of you, I pray to you. Not pray to you, but I beg of you. Just end this game with them being alive. You know, just end this. We didn't, you know, Arthur didn't pass. I'm going to go see what kind of good, honest work I can find. Grave digging or polishing some rich fella's boots or some such. Me too. See if me and the boy can find some laundry work or something. Well, I feel like I'm going to see Mike or Dutch in here. I feel like I'm more so I'm going to find Dutch. But... Oh, God. Help you, son? I'm hoping I can help you. I saw the help wanted sign outside. Sure, but uh, you're a bit old to be stacking groceries and running errands, ain't you, son? Well, uh, I ain't too proud to do nothing. As long as it's honest and it pays. <laughs> Time's hard, Mr. Uh, uh, Milton. Jim Milton. Hmm. Yeah, my wife and I and our boy. We was robbed hmm. a few days ago. Lucky to get out with our lives, we was. Now, uh, well, we need money. Uh, there's bad folk out there. Yeah, <laughs> tell me about Not it. a wagon by any chance? Uh, sure. Well, then maybe you could run some goods up to Pronghorn Ranch for me. You know, uh, head west past and Gila, then follow the road north, lead you right there. I, I don't know where that is, but I'm sure I can find it. I can leave right now, if it, you'd like. It's Getty's place. Fine fella. Uh, where's the wagon? Getty's? It's just outside. Um, I don't think I there's ever been a Gettys in this game yet. And then I can come back and get loaded. No, my boys can load you up while you go find your wife. Okay. <sighs> I'm exhausted, bro. Do not give me no more gunfights. I am over bussing. I'm tired of bussing. Do not give me no more. I'm done. I'm done. I'm out. Thank you, doctor. Hey, <laughs> how you getting on? I found some work. Me too. Delivering goods out to some ranch. Cleaning a doctor's surgery. Fine living. It is, John. Oh, it is. This is the way to it. I'll take your word on that. Well, what do you suggest now? I'll stay here. Get on with the work. You deliver them goods and then collect me. Okay. And John, I love you. Aww. Don't you forget that. Not ever now. Say it back.
Say it back. Oh, never mind. All right. Damn, what the? Oh, he got a little attitude these days, huh? Um, this game has fucked me up too much to like. I'm still, I'm still ready for anything. Does he even have guns? He don't. Okay. That don't mean we good, but you know, I highly doubt I'm gonna see like Arthur alive or something. You know, that's just real. That's really big wishful thinking, but. I just feel like we're gonna run into either Dutch or Micah. I don't know. Dutch probably. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We just gonna see when we get there. How my baby Abigail doing? Abigail? Hey, I meant Sadie. No, sir. I'm Mr. Dickens, his overseer. Jim Milton. I'm delivering some supplies from the store in Strawberry. Okay. This is quite a place. Yes. It's beautiful. Oh. They send everything? Yeah, I think so. So, partner, your boss, he looking for hands? Why? You looking for work? Yeah. Who's your boss, bro? My wife. We was in business with her family. It's either Dutch or Michael. Dirt's One of them out. got away with it's the money or something. Story. Yeah, I don't know. Married hands. It's a lot of trouble. I'm a good worker. My wife, Agatha, even our boy, Lancelot. Lancelot? <laughs> Big man around, boy? Get the hell out of here. <laughs> now, that ain't very neighborly. And threatening us is neighborly. <laughs> hey, mind if I enjoy one of these apples? Put that down. <laughs> Delicious. Oh, <laughs> when's the uh, boss man? Oh, we're gonna have to whoop his ass, and then we. I don't think there's any plans for that. We're gonna whoop his ass, then we're gonna get the job. It's some fine Scotch whiskey. Put that down. Put that down. Oh. These supplies for the season. Get off the farm. Come on. <laughs> we know when we're not wanted. Get down from there. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, bud. <laughs> you come back here. You can use that horse. And Appreciate don't you. get yourself hurt. Appreciate you. Wow. Okay. I don't know what's going on, but we, you know, we doing it. I'm literally so close to y'all. Yeah, let me cut y'all bitch ass off. Stupid ass. Why you took that left like that? Why you took that? Hey, 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 hey. Okay. Why did... Is he dead? Baby, can you get up? Jump to the wagon. Yeah, bitch. This one's got a stone in the Get your bitch ass off my shit, nigga. Oh my. Oh, I thought they was gonna start shooting at me. Wow, they just they just took that? <laughs> Bozos. Thank you. Milton, isn't it? Those boys are out of Laramie. Work for Mr. Abel. Thank you. Don't mention it. Listen. I ain't looking for no charity or nothing, but I was serious. You got work? We'll work. I can do anything. We got... We got robbed ourselves a few days back. We ain't got married hands here. You're married. You work harder than any one of them. I'm real honest, and my wife, even though she's got fancy thoughts, she'll work. You seem kind of desperate. What trouble you in? No I just trouble, told you we sir. got robbed. Aside from her brother, he tricked us and robbed her of her inheritance we're good people we'll work even Lancelot Lancelot what does Mr. Gettys need with a boy just another mouth to feed just please give us a chance I can handle myself okay you know that already yeah makes me wonder just who would have robbed you but we'll give you a chance I'll let Mr. Gettys know when him and his wife return tomorrow thank you Mr. Dickens I'll go get my wife nah no you stay here it's getting late We'll go get her in Strawberry. We'll bring her here tomorrow. We need you around in case any more of them Laramie boys turns no, up. No, I want to get my wife and my kid. A little cabin out yonder past the ranch house. Things work out, y'all can stay there. Thank you. You'll not regret this. Yep. Go get yourself settled. We'll have work for you tomorrow when Mr. Geddes returns. Bro, what is happening? Epilogue part one? Huh? There's more! <laughs> There's more! There's more! There's more. No wonder a lot of people haven't played this. <laughs> no wonder a lot of people haven't made a playthrough on this game because this game is, is long. Mr. Geddes, this is the new ranch hand. I, oh, told I don't you know who that is. No, I heard you had some trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. No, it was nothing, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm David Geddes. Pleased to meet you. John, Jim, hmm. Milton. Thank you. For the opportunity, sir. You and Mr. Dickens. He saw that. Work hard. You be honest. You'll get your keep. I promise you that. 
Boy has a family. Oh, lucky man. Then you better work extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Sir. You hear that, John Jim? Mm. Extra hard. Hey, hey, get over here. Mr. Dickens? Go find old Jim Milton here something to do. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. Yeah, you gotta do the work, bitch. Like I was on my chores anyhow. But what is happening? Say, is that your family getting in the wagon up there? Ah, believe it is. Mind if we go welcome them? Not at all. Hey, is it true what they said about you when you arrived? It, that you ran off those hired guns? Look, can we uh not discuss this in front of my wife? Oh, uh, no. Sure. Yeah, of course, mister. I don't want to worry her. Oh, yeah. I hear that. Oh, look at all oh, fancy. This is Milton. Jim Milton. How fine you seem. This kind man just collected us. Thank you, sir. I think we can be okay here. It's ranching work. This place is kind of... It's fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Real wise, Jim. What was I supposed to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. I didn't have Maybe. much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, when you're done in here, come on out and lend a hand. Baby, come on now. Like, I was just supposed to let my shit get robbed? I was going to milk the cows. Come on, I'll do it. You are gonna milk the cows? Sure. They gonna want well, me to be like a bodyguard or something. I don't know. I, I thought you was uh, an assassin. I'm a ranch hand. A new one at that. When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Weren't nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It was about time someone stood up to them fellers. No. Oh. Where are you from, anyway, partner? Around, you know. Up north, mostly. Been in these parts before, but that was years ago. <laughs> John been doing his pull-ups. Well, I'm going back kind of... If it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? <laughs> Good lord, no. <laughs> Nothing like that. Yeah, we used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking. Yeah, but most of them drifted off. Okay. You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You don't do that motion no more. Get down, I'll show you how. Approach her calm now. She don't take too kindly to surprises. Damn. Don't give me... You gonna get me milking gameplay? All right. Almost got a pail full. That looked like a whole bunch. <laughs> hey, Paul. Is that your boy? Sure. Hey, Lancelot. Well, hey, Lancelot. Hey. No! Gonna make a dairy Don't give me back to the gameplay, Nick. How about you and the boy uh, help me clean out the stables? No! Yeah, pick up. God damn. <laughs> 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 John Marston, Terror of the Turds. Oh, uh, <laughs> Baby. Hey. Hey. Where's Jack? Shoveling shit. Pursuit a better life you want. Same as I've been. Won't do him no harm. I know. Got the haircut. Guess maybe we can last here. Survive. Do a little better than survive for once. I'm mm. tired of fleeing, John. So, well, you know. Me too. Mm. Aww, cute! Where my girl at? Like. I don't want to hear no screaming cop. Bro, I, I really thought that was the end of the game. Now we're like John doing a bunch of stuff. I'm I'm so confused. Hey, Milton. Can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. 
Can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers. Can y'all stop looking into my shit, bro? Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. Like, leave me alone. Before you came here. I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. Mm. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. But I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. I'm saying, can you just leave him be, bro? Give me like, damn. This fence. Damn. Yep. There's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. That's what she said. You're not funny, nigga. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. We playing a home build simulator now. I'm I'm like, bro, what what's what are we what's going to happen? I know this can't allude to like a Red Dead 3. There's no way. There's no way. Know much about bulls, Milton? Uh, just the basics. Don't make him mad. Hey, Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. I know how Mr. it Milton. feels. Angus is your Come boss's on. son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Come on, move! Oh my God. That's not how you come a bull. That's not how you come a bull. That's what your dumb ass get. Lasso. And there goes the fence I spent four hours on. And you want me to do what now? Come here. Hold me. Hold me. All right. Help. Hold me. What you want me to do with it? Mr. Bull, please. How am I supposed to? Uh, Mr. Bull. Mr. Bull. Mr. Bull. Mr. Bull. That's quite enough, sir. <laughs> Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. What y'all was talking about over there? Good, son. A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. Why well, don't trust, well, I don't trust dude on the right right here? Good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. What is going on? <laughs> hey. Oh, hold on. I'll get the coffee home. I mean, I could. You could do something else to wake me up. <laughs> hey, let me close the window. Like, I'm headed oh shit, Jack in here. Fuck. <laughs> Whoa, that scared me. What the hell? What are we doing? What are we doing? I said, Abe, yes, where are the other hands? Uh, I thought I said I don't rightly know, Mr. Getty, sir. Well, what good is that to me? We got three horses lost, possibly more, a mare about to full, sir, and no hands to help with any of it. I'm supposed to be heading into town. This place is chaos. Hey, Pa! Can I get some help? Pa! Milton, Milton, you good with horses? I'm okay. I'll do whatever needs doing, sir. Uh, good man. Can you help my boy, my youngest, Duncan? He will insist on riding Jeremiah, a horse that is far too strong for him. And my wife will need help with this mare. Abe? Sir? You and Dickens better not make any more mistakes like you did today, you hear? No, sir. Thank you. Both of you. He said no, sir. Come on, he's over here. I'm good. You get on. Go find them horses. No, no, no. I'll show you. And since you showed up, runaway horse has been to some of our problems and i am thankful for that i ain't done too much i ain't much of a rancher oh heck you hey maybe them laramie boys weren't so tough after all huh? maybe i could have handled them of course you could they're just loud mouths yeah <laughs> so uh is that what the boss is doing in town some business with them boys or something well when Mr. Geddes goes into town, well, it ain't exactly for, uh, business. Oh, Lord. Uh, okay then. What the hell does that mean? Uh, you Mr. Milton? I thought you were gonna help me. I am. I was. I'm sorry. Come on. 
I need a man's help. Duncan, what have I told you about distracting the hands? I'm sorry, Ma. <sighs> well, I hope you'll listen to me better than my husband. Thanks, Jim. You're doing fine, kid. Give him a carrot when you put him down. This is the stall. I'm so exhausted from crying, bruh. So, you know much about birth of foal, Milton? Not too much. Oh my god, where does my husband find men like you? Still, we all know where he goes in town, and it ain't hunting for hands. It's Damn, is he like cheating on you or something? Stick a hand in there and get a ha! feeling for where the legs are. Go on. Eh? Whatever you say, ma'am. Don't give me the prompt. Don't, don't raise the black bars. You're going to raise the black... Got okay, now hold on. Put the foot, nigga. I think she may be okay. Ooh. Great. We'll make a proper hand of you yet, Mr. Milton. I hope so. Thank you. Oh, and Mr. Milton, feel free to make a call at the house sometime. I knew, I knew she was gonna do that. You nasty bitch. So the man cheating on you, and now you wanna get. We gotta Perhaps leave. Even now. We a drink. To toast our new arrival. We gotta leave. <laughs> I'd like that, but my wife is expecting me back. Oh, you're married? Yeah. I didn't know we had any married hands. Yeah, I'm the first. Yeah. We we have a boy. Maybe you've seen him around. Oh, uh, I'm I'm busy. Uh, yeah. Too busy for social calls. Yeah, of course. Bye. Good day, Mr. Milton. Hey, John. Jim. <sighs> Sorry. So, this is what you wanted. Fake names, which, by the way, Dickens sees clean through. John. Us on the run. John, this is our chance to make something new. Come on. Please. I think John has had that, that cowboy built in him so Damn. long, he doesn't like, I don't know. How's he, he been? He's not used to the normal life. He's been kind of withdrawn. Quiet, you know. Sure. Take him out, please. Come on, boy. Let's go for a walk. Come on. This is so odd, bro. Round to the left. What do you see? The pony? Get on him. We're taking a ride. Duncan, Mr. Getty's boy lent it to you. Let's go. How you doing? Fine. Can we go home? What the? No. We just got back. Son, you won this time. Whoa, but we both rode hard, and you're riding, it's got a lot better. Thanks. Hey, you keep practicing your riding. Sure, are they busting? Hello, oh lord, here we go. That's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> you want to watch your mouth, boy. You will be the first one we kill. Leave him alone. Uh. <laughs> oh, careful, boys. Careful. Yeah. Look at this tough guy. Get out of here. How oh, fancy pants get is paying you to be tough for him, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. Said he had some problems with vermin. Yeah. Oh, listen to this. Real I feel funny. like I'm playing Red Dead 3 right now. <laughs> Weave, stupid eye. <laughs> I just got done beating Micah ass, so like, this is not gonna end well for you. Bro, my camera's dying. I've been recording for like four hours. I thought we were done. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Bro, I gotta split this up somehow. Anyways, let's get back to the ass beating. What you wanna do? Stupid eye. Yep, yep, stupid eye. You gonna block? Like, you gonna, you gonna, I'm gonna smell like cow dung, boys. you smelling like blood, stupid eye. 
Oh my goodness, the combo. Oh, he got, damn, he got down on you. He said, you see this face? Yeah, bitch. Yeah, I'm about to knock your ass up. You need help? Oh my. Yeah. Oh, no. Get off that man. Get off He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in the brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. I'm end up busting again, bro. It never leaves. With your lot in life, You're married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> I'm gonna take that jacket off you. What you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you, bud. Bro, is this Red we'll Dead Three? Like, what is and going on? Fuck. I thought we were done. We'll be back, <laughs> bro. Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. The tough part about recording is you don't know when the finale is. Like, I prepared myself for this to be the finale, and it is. But then, like, we have more. So, like, do I keep this as one video? I can't, bro. Like, this is this together is going to be, like, six hours of editing. I'm not doing that. And somebody Stop calling me scam likely shut my ass. Storybook hero, will you? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. What's up with you, baby? Like... He came at me. You pretty, but you be you be you be doing too much sometimes, baby. Where's my baby Sadie at? And I don't want to like. Never mind. Actually, John, I guess the trick is to decide by who. Oh shit. Oh. Now, dear, I won't hear any more of it. You won't hear any of it. Not in front of the men. You toad. Oh. I smile, smile. Do not embarrass me. Hello? Mr. Geddes? Hey, I heard we had another incident with the uh, Laramie boys. Yeah, there was an incident. Well, I mean to scare me. Are you scared? A little. I've got a lot invested in this place, and, and not just the land, but, but my family. It's, then he gonna have us protected. He gonna pay us more to protect it. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. I know you will. So how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> How'd you get on? Okay, I guess. Better? Sure, I'm just He looks tired. so different with short hair, bro. I know. You good, baby? What happened? Anybody want some more? Uh, no, no, I'm thank good. You. <laughs> Not a Mr. Pearson. John Marston. <laughs> You're such a pig. <laughs> You're not a very good cook, huh, baby? Cute. All right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. I ain't got no like dominoes on. Good night, night, Jack. Good night, Mama. I'm gonna say, where Jack's leaving? Good night, Jack. Good night, Damn, Mom. John, you can't you can't do nothing with. <laughs> you got your whole son in the same room. And they can't do it anyway. They bussing. What are you? What are you doing? My job. I have a game. Here we go. About the bus. Lock this door behind me. Don't open it unless you know it's me. Oh, all right. Damn. <laughs> Over by the stables. Find Tom Dickens. All right. Rich man. What's happening? Who's this? New Nigga hand. about to whoop your ass. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, take this combo. Take, come on. Yo, yeah, wait, 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 wait your turn! <laughs> wait your turn! Wait your turn! Oh, he thought hate! John, y'all asked me to go to the they got boxing these days, right? This one they used to do the little the little uh the little uh when they used to do the little the little the fuck is that? <laughs> like, you should, <laughs> they used to do that? John, you could be in the you could be in the boxing, man. You could really get you some cash in there. They killed Mr. Tobert! Who is that? They've stolen my goddamn cattle. You men okay? I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. I can't believe he thinks he can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, I guess sir. we are. Yeah. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. All right, Jim. I know you can handle yourself. A little. Go get your guns and head out. Guns? Oh, don't play coy with me, son. We need your help. Damn. I don't care what you used to do or what your, your, your name is. This is the land of second chances. Understood. Okay. He don't want to do it, but you know. Come in, it's me. 
What was it? Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. God, I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, look at him getting the gun. What are you doing in that thing? Mr. No, Getty's I don't want him to. Us. We... I... What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. Damn. Damn. I'll lead the way. This is gonna be the last we hear out of them. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm, I yeah. feel like I, I hate that we have to do this, bro. Like, we left this life behind and now we got a bus again? I don't want to. Off your horses here. We'll be better on foot. Okay. If you say so. That's the place up ahead. There's our cows. A couple guards out front. A couple more around the side, I imagine. Let's get a closer look. Let's go. Back in your natural habitat. Yeah, there's plenty of guards. I'm gonna head straight in. Yep, Tom, you head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. Oh, we just. Hey! Hey! You boys been coming up to Pronghorn? I thought I'd come down here. Get to cover, get to cover. Oh, the music bumping. You good. Where you at? Let me move up, let me move up, let me move up. Oh my gosh. Y'all hear this music right now? This music is crazy. You're damn straight. Oh, long shot. Ugh. I see you, I see you, I see you. I said I see you. I said I. I said I. I said I. I said I. There we go. I didn't even know what hit. I'm skipping off. Get, get the cover. Get the cover. Holy crap. Hold on. Let me. Shut up. Shut up. Damn, horse. You got lucky, cat. I'm coming. Whoa. That's not what I meant. That's not what. Man, man. Hold on, John. What's your dead eye looking like? Oh, it sounds different, too. Damn, John. Okay. Come on. You see me? When they come do something. Bro, are you in here? Where are you, big fella? Yeah. Come on. Bro, you want to fight? Like, it's not going to... Right. Right. I just did this like a couple minutes ago. It's not going to work. Come on. I'm going to beat your ass again. Come on. I can't see shit. It's so dark in here. Yep, come on. I don't need to see. Yep, come on. Can I can okay, okay. I really can't see. Yep. There we go. Yep, yep. 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 Come on. Come on. Come on. Look at the weed, bitch. Come on, bitch! Ugh. Ugh. Get him again. Get him again. You know that woman of yours got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's got to make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my seats. As long as she. Pussy! Like. Like I was gonna let you finish talking about my baby. Like, oh, fuck it. Like whatever. It is what it is, bro. You talking about my baby? Right, you gotta. You talking about my woman? You gotta die. Yeah, you getting the sheets with the devil? Cause you going. You in hell. You ain't going to heaven. Hey, you're back. You did real well, Mr. Milton. This man can really fight. Save the whole place. Ah, uh, that weren't nothing. Well, you. Oh, you. <laughs> You saved my life. No need to say nothing, sir. Just doing my job. Now, I don't think they'll be back tonight, but how about, Abe, just in case you stay up? Yep. You see anything or hear anything, you like find Like I said, he gonna, be the, he gonna be the guard for the Three ranch. Times. We'll all come running. Will do. Uh, well said. And thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. 
Just glad to be of service, sir. <laughs> I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. I know you're gonna be mad at me. I'm sorry. Listen, baby. What? What? Why is he looking at me like... What choice did I have? Just answer me that. What was I supposed to do? Oh my gosh. God damn it, Abby. You too, son? Alright, whatever. When I'm supposed to sleep on the table? Man, I'm gonna sleep in my bed. I don't give a damn. Like, Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. Mm. Bro, this is like, I feel like I'm playing a whole nother game. How you getting on? Surviving. I think. Here. I'll get you some coffee. Only thing I know how to do is... Well, you know, undertakers like me. Cattle? Not so much. That ain't true. You could no be more than that. Get the fuck, bitch. Rustled horses, not raised them. Stole cattle, not birthed them. I was, I was reading the newspaper. I was reading about a old ranch, Beecher's Hope, down by Blackwater. Was you? Well, Jack read it to me, but I thought maybe we could raise some money. Bank could lend us the rest. We could be happy, John. We Bank could... loans? I got a goddamn price on my head, woman. I know. I know all about that. Every time we about to get somewhere, make something, you go and show the entire world that you ain't Jimmy Milton. Every place we've been, it's been the same. We start doing okay, and then boom. You act like the big man with the gun. Uh, you Tired, John. Your child is right I there. I was dreaming a little. At least give me that. Just feels hopeless. You're, you're doing better. Milton! Milton, ma'am. Why the fuck you open? Bitch, don't open my door. Like, what the fuck? My woman could have been butt-ass naked, bro. You should get hit for that. Mr. Geddes needs you to head over to Strawberry in the wagon and collect some mail for him at the post office. Sure. I'll take the boy with me. He's getting soft. Lancelot. Come on. Jim, if you're heading that way, can you pick up a parcel for me? A dress I ordered. I think it's in your name? My name. I, I think so. One's in your name, and the other one's in mine. O only one should have come in by now. How much shopping you done? Oh, yes. A real keen purchaser of goods, me. Look at me. <laughs> okay, Lancelot. Make a man out of you yet. Not too much of a man, mine. He's only a boy. Just gonna show him how to drive the wagon a little. We'll save the real exciting realities of adulthood for another day. Come on, get! You take care now. Of course. Um. It's nice getting out of the house, huh? I like being what the in the house, Pa. Go back to the road, Pa. Um, why are we going in a loop? Like, what the I hell was that? Just about doing things you like, boy. What happened the other night with those men? Did you kill them? I did what I had to do to protect you. Ma said it was pride or something. Your ma was wrong about that. Where where is this little story gonna go? Cause like, dude, I thought like we were gonna see Arthur die and then the credits were gonna roll and that was gonna be it. But like we're we I've been playing for like an extra hour. <laughs> Not that I'm complaining about it, but I'm just like. How is this gonna go? This is gonna be the last minute for right now. I'm I'm exhausted, bro. Like, I didn't cry like three times. For now. I didn't cry like three times. I'm I'm tired, bro. You know, I think this is the longest I've seen you without a book in your hand. It was foolish to forget mine, sir. Look, I got some business to attend to with the clerk. I leave you with the wagon. Can I trust you not to drive off with it? Oh, I think I can be trusted to that. Very good. You know something about to happen, man. They didn't got word that they man's and got bust and, and packed up. They ain't gonna be like, nah, baby. There's a dude going by the name of Jim Milton. And then, you know. All right. Here we are. You all right, son? Sure. Well, cheer up a little. 
You wait here. I won't be long. Okay. And if you behave, I might let you drive us home. Can't wait. I'm about to say he might be like, yay. Yay. Hi. I'm here to name. My name? Um uh, Jim Milton. Jim Milton. Oh Lord. Hmm. <laughs> nope. Nothing here. Maybe try Marston. John Marston. It's a long story. Okay. John Marston. Why would Mars Oh god, I just oh fuck. Oh no, I see that dude looking by Why would she use his real real name? Why would she use his real real name? Marston. Oh no. Nope. Nothing here for that name either. Try Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. I'm scared. Oh, here you are. Yes, here we are. Yeah. And also, I'm here to pick up the deliveries for Pronghorn Ranch. David Getty sent me. Pronghorn? Yes. Uh, oh, uh, uh, sign oh, uh, here. Uh, yes, sir. Yes. We have a bunch of stuff for you. <sighs> We're about to hear your son scream outside you out. or something. I'll take these. You get the rest of the stuff. Don't tell me the horse gone. Here. Let me help you with this, Mr. Marston. Uh, it's uh, mostly Milton these days. It's a long story. Whatever you say, Mr. Milton. It's not important. Take care now. Give my regards to Gettys. Thank you very much, mister. Okay. Bro. Let's get out of here. Everything okay, Pa? Sure. I hope so, at least. Oh, shit. Here. You take the reins a little. I ain't sure. Come on, son. You'll enjoy it if you try a little harder. Bro, I am okay. not trying to... Okay, Pa. I'm a wanted man. I'm not trying to bust while my son is here, bro. That sounds crazy, but you get what I'm trying to say. Do I have a gun on me? I don't think We're so. back to Pronghorn, okay? So, wait. We've come all the way out here, and we just gonna turn around and go back? That's what we're doing. Turns out, uh, I missed the seclusion of the ranch more than I figured for. Don't you want to go to the store or the saloon or anywhere? We're going back, okay, boy? But I've been sitting in this wagon I don't know how long. But nothing. Keep on driving and watch the road. Yes, sir. I love this Thank game, you. bro. Jesus. Mind your father, okay? I got my reasons, even if I don't care to explain them. Okay, I'm just checking. Yes, I'm just sir. checking. I ain't gonna lie. With all the shit we went through, bro, I'd have left the country. Like... Who's this? Sorry, sir. Was that a question for me? Oh shit! No. Is that the no, dude? Keep trying. Look, 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 look. What's wrong, Pa? Nothing. Let me scout this shit. He, he chasing? Yup. Let's speed this motherfucker up, bro. I have no guns. I have no guns. Oh, he tailing us, bro. He tailing us. Well, I don't like driving across here. It's the same as any other road. Look where you want to go, and the horse will follow. Look, okay. look. I think the horse is getting skittish. He'll be all right. Is somebody back there? Just keep driving. Huh? Who's that up front? Nothing. Man, here we go. Just take that right. Take that right. Take that right. <laughs> yep. I can't speed up. Oh shit! Now all three of them. Yup. One. Okay. What? What's wrong? Don't Two. Look Oh, Pog, hey. those men. Shut up! Just, just stay calm. See that fallen tree? When we get there, stop the wagon, jump down, and hide. Oh, Pa. You need to do exactly as I say, boy. Here, now! Uh, come on! Quick! Now! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, son, you wait here. You don't move? Or say nothing until I speak to you. You hear? Yes, sir. Head down. Okay, gentlemen. Oh, he got the blinky on him! What do you boys want with us? Oh, we just want to have a friendly chat. Oh, really? Are you John Morrison? You sure look like him. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just here with my son. 
kill a fella out in Roanoke a few months back. Who? No. Wasn't me. That was my brother. I don't give a damn. I'm real sorry, friend, but he was trying to rob me. You're talking bullshit, mister. Kill him. Oh, oh let, let me. Oh, my. Did you crazy? Pussy? It's okay. You're okay. What? Why? What? It's okay. It's okay. Oh, this is such a complicated thing, bro. Keep them eyes closed. Let's go. Come on. Get out. Damn. Damn. Oh, dear. Those men. I told you not to look, boy. Are they dead? I didn't have much of a choice. You saw that. Now, compose yourself. You killed them, Paul. Son, Bro! I need you to hold it together. Like they were gonna kill us. You were real brave back there. Real brave. You did exactly like I said. Really? Uh-huh. Yeah, you you did good, baby boy. If you hadn't listened, things could have gone real wrong for us. Jack. Oh, he need a, he need a paper bag. You know, yeah, distract him. Talk about something else. Branch. You read to her about it, didn't you? Mm -hmm. What was it called? Mm -hmm. What was the name, boy? Beecher's Hope. That's right. Beecher's Hope. Over by Blackwater. You like the idea of that, huh? Us on the ranch? I don't know. I can see you as a rancher's boy. Like Duncan He's trying hard to, to distract him. I wasn't so sure, but... Yeah. That kind of life might suit us. Wouldn't be such a chore if the horses we were cleaning up after was ours, would it? <laughs> no, it wouldn't. Mm. Okay, here we are. That was an uh, eventful trip. Go say hi to your mother. You know she's gonna be mad, yeah. Damn! What happened? Oh, Lord. Yeah. It's... I don't... We got shot at. Shot at? What happened? Well, we got followed, and then... We... Followed by who? Probably someone who knew me. If we didn't get to them particulars, I'm sorry. My son. Our son! Bro, is she gonna leave us? Your dress caused all the problem. It weren't even a dress. It was a gift for I you. I was about to say it was a gift. Damn. <laughs> it just never ends, bro. Motherhood. Bro, I'm about to end this shit. I need to I need food. I need water. Mr. Jim. Hey. Uh, there's a telegram messenger for you over there. In near the house. Oh Lord. There is? Okay. Thanks, Abe. That's sus. Okay, let me let me see who this is first. What do you think you want? I have no idea. Excuse me, mister. I'm Jim Milton. Heard you had a telegram for me? Yes. Here. Sign there. Thank you. Huh? Jim, stop. If you're the JM I know, stop. It's Sadie Adler. <laughs> Discuss. Pay good. Meet me in saloon in Valentine. I'm there most days. Stop. Sadie Adler. He meant stop because there's a I'll period. Nah, no, I gotta see how my baby looking. Nah, I gotta see how my baby looking. I gotta see how my baby looking. I gotta see how my baby. <laughs> Abigail. Here, her and the son left. I literally called it. They left. With a note! Bro, this is so f sad, bro. Darling John, a kind lady in the village helped me write this. She had men problems of her own, but that's a different story. Listen, I have begged you, but it don't seem to make much difference. Damn! I've tried everything I know to make you grow up. And you know I love you, but loving you means I can't watch you do this. I feel like I'm time reading the, the letter time, that Arthur got again. Because of your behavior and your decisions. 
we got a son. I got a son. And I love our son enough that I can't have him around while you're like this. I had so many dreams, John. I hoped you would change. We all saw what happened to them that didn't, but oh, you... Oh, man. Part of you is hell-bent on ending up the same way. And I love you too much to watch that no more. Abigail. Damn. Oh lord, what's the gift? Like a new fit? Some pajamas? <laughs> Where's the wife, Milton? Uh, she's out. I saw her leaving with the boy. And the bags. What's going on? You married, Mr. Dickens? No. That don't surprise me. What'd she do? Catch you with a showgirl? Or hear about you shooting more fellas over by Strawberry? Just who are you, Jim Milton? I'm a family man. I can handle a gun, sure. Them men shot at me. Just interested, that's all. Ain't nothing interesting. Unless you find gossip about a man's marriage worthy of your time. Guess not. There's work to be done, unless you're running off too. I ain't going nowhere. I'm here to work. Gotta save money, get her what she wants. What does she want? She wants a place of her own. Said she found a plot up at Beecher's Hope. You? A rancher? You'll starve. Probably. <laughs> Keep yourself busy. Take your mind off it. Damn. Okay. Return to work. <laughs> I can't remember how long has it oh yeah it says several some years later some years later oh I gotta see how she look I hope I hope no her she probably still busting it's the shits I'm still a, I'm still a wreck bro I already I already miss Arthur bro I wonder how this is gonna go man like what is what is the purpose of all of this I hope Oh, John, don't die or something. Like, somebody catches up with him or something. So is he just going to avoid Sadie? Like, he just don't want to meet up with her now? Looks like it's been days, bro. Well, as we've seen, if he don't want to find them, they sure going to find him. So I'm sure somebody going to pop up. Wow, he, he, really, he really didn't go to Sadie. Damn. Well, Sadie know where you live, so... That's her fool. Hey, you know, I was wrong about you. you turned into a fine worker, Jim Milton. Hair grew a little oh, bit, thank okay? You. Means a lot. Hey, you think I could speak with Mr. Geddes? See if maybe he's open to offering me some guidance? No, I'm sure he'd be happy to hear you speak, at least. Thank you, Mr. Dickens. It's crazy. The, we, the, we, like doing regular work but my my chest is still like tight bro because like this game just makes me uneasy i see that gun on the right hey son how's that bull fine mr milton your father in can i have a word sure i'll just get him pa hey, i'm right right here <sighs> what's the problem milton Sorry for the disturbance, sir. Oh, no problem. My wife, she just began her morning discourse on the subject of my faults. Mm. Experience I think every man can relate to. In some way, I ain't got no girl yet, so... My yeah, wife also home. has issues with some of the decisions I've made. Real issues. Hmm? Do you believe a man can change, sir? Where is this heading? I yes, I don't can. know. Any, let me tell you, the little war, just let me, let me spit, let me spit. Anybody can change. But it is incredibly difficult to do. And it is incredibly rare for a human person, for a human person, a human being, to look at themselves in the mirror and be like, man, I don't, I don't, I don't like this version of myself. I don't like this person that I'm becoming. I, I'd really like to change it. I, I don't want to be this person anymore. 
So it's it's very possible. But you know, a lot of people don't really, you know, do it. <clears throat> I've tried to be a good hand. I've worked hard to secure your property. And for that, we are grateful. And you've paid me well besides. The thing is, I suppose, I need to get a place of my own. Mm. So I can prove to my wife that I've changed. Mm. I understand. But I ain't got much money. I ain't asking to borrow none. But maybe you could go to the bank and put in a good word so they could give me a loan. A loan, huh? So I can buy that place, Beecher's Hope? Yes, I know it. Yes, of course, sure. It'd be, it'd be my pleasure. I hope this Take ends well for advice, him. Take my Milton. Take your money and go buy passage on a boat. Go to Brazil and forget all about family. Huh? I'm just joking, son. Oh, how about Just bro? make sure you deal with Ansel Atherton at the bank. He's I'm about a to say, you was on my good side, bro. Here's my name. Tell him to ask me direct himself. You'll get what you need. Thank you, sir. I feel like I it's not going to go and well. I was dumb once, too. You'll get her back. Yeah. Oh, look at him. Yes! I hope it ends well for him, man. I've had enough of death, shooting, sadness. Like, I'm, I'm, can we just, you know? Even though I know I'm, going, I'm about to get more of that. Are you about to put the old fit on? You really want to put the old fit on? Should you do that? You ain't got no new fits after all? Yeah! Okay. Oh, he got that shit on now. I ain't dumb. And I'm somewhat cultured. You know, I, even though, bro, even though I don't be knowing everything about every series, I know a little. That's the fit he had on in RDR1, is it not? Correct. Oh, he got that shit. I know y'all. I know y'all. I know y'all was losing y'all minds with this. Oh, that's fire. <laughs> or at least like a, a reimagined version of it. Cause he sure wasn't wearing that in this game. Oh, that, that looks good, man. Do I have my guns back? Yes. Oh no, I'm not. Am I happy about? I don't know if I'm happy about that. <laughs> I don't know if I'm happy about that, bro. I'm gonna be real with you. I I don't know if I'm happy about that. Okay. No, wow. Wow. We're playing more. We're playing more. Too fast, and I've been living too Oh, that horse getting it. Damn, why my horse and the horse I couldn't get? So now we just playing the game as John again. Bro, I wonder how far this, like, am I, it, like, how long is this? Like, is this, like, the, the length of, like, a whole, like, DLC or? I can't believe Micah and Dutcher live. Oh, I don't know if they live, but they got to run off. Like, what? I need to see my baby. 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 Oh, I'm so scared. I thought I told you to leave it, Bubba. And I thought to myself, who this little girl thinks she tell anything to? <laughs> Look at my baby in the drip! <laughs> I ain't got no business with you right now. What that mean? For the last time. Leave me alone! Or what? She got her own... <laughs> uh, Get the hell out! here before she kills us all you you same old same old you know lord have mercy oh my gosh i'm in love bro yeah that brother's starving rocksteady y'all need to make a red dead redemption 3 with her as the main character you got to bro a widow who's a bad bro that's that's literally like a fire plot for a game or just a story in general bro john marston it is good to see you <laughs> you too <laughs> I thought I heard a oh. rumor he was alive. Jim she got her own. Oh, oh my, bro. Guess I didn't do a real good job of hiding my identity. <laughs> we didn't hear nothing about you. You, you killed feller up by Roanoke. Sure did. I thought that sounded like you and Abigail and Jack. She. She's fine. <laughs> she was always so kind to me. I'm looking to buy us a property, Beecher's Hope, west of Blackwater. I'm kind of a farmer now. <laughs> and you? Oh, you know how it is. Bounties um, mostly mm -hmm, and some yeah. other stuff. Yeah, she's yeah, Arthur, yeah. bro. Hey, you any interest in bounties? No, uh, I've gone straight. Huh? I mean, if sort you of. give me the option, like... Oh, well, it's legal. I'm usually. She looks then, so badass. Maybe. Come on, then. 
What? Bro. Where are we headed? She is so fine. Got on the run from New York. What type of horse? Surprise for him. What would he do? Rob a bank. With a gun? No, with a pan. He's an accountant, I think. Sounds easy. Come Don't on. jinx it. We got a bit of a ride. I know. Bro. Good morning. Your telegram. You said you had something to discuss. I didn't think we'd be chasing down an outlaw. There's something else. What? Micah. Micah? You had to ruin the moment. Bro, it's early in the morning. I'm not trying to get, like, angry. I'm not trying to scream. Only thing I bet, if it's something about Micah, all I know is I better be able to kill him. That's it. I think so. I heard of someone sounded like him uh, about a year back. Okay. We always said, if we found him. Put him in the grave. I know what we said we'd do. That ain't changed. Ugh. I didn't think I'd see any of you again after you left for the Yukon. Now we came back. Didn't strike it rich, as you can see. But you're a rancher now. I aim to be. Probably why I can't afford it. <laughs> mm. This country's becoming real civilized. That folk won't be around for long. Let's ride! With my baby again. Oh my goodness. Only part that ruined is that she talked about Micah. That's it, bro. If we could, if Dutch can go fuck off, whatever. He, I, whatever. If he, uh, whatever. But Micah, he gotta die. He gotta die. He gotta die. <laughs> die today. Bro does not deserve to live, live scot free. Alright, see what you can find. Like I said, feller's name is Nathan Kirk, banker, bald, forty-five. Okay. You head up that way. I'll meet you in a bit. She is so. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, you seen a fella? Fella from New York? Bald guy? Yeah. A few New Yorkers come here in search of the West. Very this descriptive. A wanted man. I work for the government. Uh, sort of. His name's Nathan Kirk. Mr. Kirk? But he's so charming. Is he staying here? He's, uh, up in room three. I appreciate you, bro. I'm gonna go pay him a visit. It's government business. How exciting. You gotta work on your, like, talking, uh, John. You're not making it very believable. It's, um, um, uh, God, uh, government, government business. Yeah, yeah. So if you hear some, some screaming, just, you know, continue reading your newsletter. Mr. Kirk! Mr. Kirk, you in there? Who is it? It's just a friend. <coughs> I'm on you. I'm on you. Jump down there. Baby, you don't. Got him? Oh, shut up. Can I jump down there too? Or like. Can I jump on a horse? Oh, okay. Remember, we want him alive though. Okay, lasso his ass. Lasso. Come on. This horse is fast as hell. He went right. I see it, baby. I see it. Oh yeah, we back. It it kind of sucks, but I you know I don't miss the gameplay. I mean I miss the gameplay. Bro, why all y'all got like Kentucky Derby horses, bro? Where are you going? Oh, she's taking a shortcut. She's taking a shortcut. Come on, I'm on you. You hide it forever, Ricky. When I catch you, Ricky. Ricky, when I catch you, Ricky. Ricky, when I catch you, Ricky. Ricky, when I catch you, Ricky. Look, shortcut. You saw that long shot? Oh my goodness. Okay, John. Thanks for that, Mr. Kirk. Real fun. I, I'm an innocent man, but it's all a mistake. My wife, my wife is a, is a desperate woman. Right. How, how you married, sir? None of your business. <laughs> Quiet now. Where shall I send the money? I ain't been paid yet. Hold on to it for me. Need to speak to the bank over in Blackwater. Get a loan for the property. Might make him happy to see I've got a boss. So I've got a couple of other leads I could use your help with if you're interested. I'm usually at the saloon in Blackwater. I need money pretty bad. You, so ain't, you know, I ain't passing that up. Oh I'll my god. Come goodness. find you. Don't leave me, baby. Oh my god. Bro, usually they give you like a little 
cool maybe like 20 30 minute bro i feel like i'm playing the third game so why is micah even still here did they not did did mike and dutch not take the money or did just dutch take the money like all i need is for this game to end with john happy with his family and sadie alive i low-key need that more than john happy bro excuse me sir can i can i help you good day come on in yeah i'm looking for mr atherton i'm a friend of mr getty's over at pronghorn ranch Oh, yeah, Mr. Atherton is in his office. Look how he hey, judged us. In. Look how he Thank judged you. us. He yeah. thought we was trouble already. That's crazy. Is this you, bro? Hello? Can I help you? I know you saw me. The door's open. I hope open. so. Like... <clears throat> I want a loan, sir. A line of credit so I can buy some property. What property? An old ranch, Beecher's Hope. That old dump? I, I know it ain't much, but I ain't much of a farmer either. But I will get there. That is a very unusual way of asking for a loan. Mr. Milton. M Marston. Marston. Oh. Only folk around here call me Milton. It's kind of a joke, I guess. <laughs> a joke, huh? And which folk? Mr. Geddes. Uh -huh. I work for him. He said that you could help me out. I mean, if you can. So old David Geddes told you I'm the kind of man to loan a man with two names money so he can buy a rundown farm on account of his lack of farming skills, huh? Are you gonna be a cool dude Don't or a dickhead, bro? When you put it like that. <laughs> well, how would you put it? Sorry to waste your time, sir. Oh, sit down. I'm sure we can figure something out. Now, of course, we'll be expecting you to make regular payments, and given a lack of much evidence you got any means of repaying, the terms won't be too great. But if my cousin vouches for you, it'll be okay with the bank. Really? <laughs> Absolutely. They're all family, huh? Thank you. Now, of course, we'll be expecting our money back regular as clockwork until the debt settled. Otherwise, the farm reverts to the bank, no matter how much you paid. This is gonna go bad, bro. Mm -hmm. oh, well, I'm scared. Check out the land while I fix the contracts and talk to Mr. Geddes. Oh, I heard there's squatters up there. We've been having so many problems recently, they'll need clearing on. Sure. Well, come back when you're done and we'll fix up the paperwork. Oh, boy. This goddamn clinch in my chest, man. I hate it. This game is 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 way too powerful. I don't, I need to be done with this game. If I could interest you in bounty work, the posters on the wall. Elias Green captured Dilla like he's wanted for the war for murder, for murder and mutilation of six set of, Wow, yeah, bro, you gotta go. Is a member of the Skinner Brothers gang. Oh hell no! Animal skin, bear hat, buskin. Yeah, you're not coming back alive, sir. We're really playing like, like this is not. We're not. <laughs> I'm still just like, I'm just, I'm just so surprised because like, bro, like we played this. This is this is the longest game I've ever played, and like we still got more. That's one thing for sure. Rockstar did not leave y'all hungry for more, or maybe y'all they did. I don't know. Some of y'all got crazy appetites. Help a blind man. Okay, sure. Embrace those who love you, not the memory of those who pretended to. Uh, right. Okay, friend. All the best now. Spin facts. Oh, why why didn't you jump? You usually jump, baby. Sir? Well, I feel like he like in the trees or something. Skinner, what did it say? Skinner territory. Oh nah, bro. I was about to say I just heard some busting. Oh, what's going on? This one's still breathing. Oh, speak. I'll turn your skull to my pommel. There's more? Oh, my. Bozo, you good, sir? He is not good. Damn. Them horses is going crazy. They're scaring me a little. Baby girl, let's get out of here. Now, John has a, uh, like a little meter, too. Should I really? I guess if it's there, I should be careful of that, too. So, do good deeds and not just kill anybody. It feels so weird not having money. 
Like, I literally, I barely got $20. Yeah, bro! With Arthur, Arthur had that stack on him. Arthur had about three grand on him. What is, what is up with, bro? I wonder where Charles at. I don't really care about Javier or the uh, number one Glazer, but RP to like Shawty. I forgot. I keep forgetting her name. Old lady. She was she was with us. She was with Arthur and them. And then Micah bitch has just shot her. Like, damn. Bro, this is literally like the fourth time in one game. So this the little this the little house. Hey, but it's my spot now, okay? Can I help you, friend? Yeah, this this is my house now. I hope so. Who's in charge here? No one, mister. This is a free country. <laughs> now that I ain't so sure about. Yeah. Listen, I'm buying this land. I'm afraid. I'm afraid you guys are gonna have to go somewhere else. Don't make me press R2, bro. Who's this? Don't make I me press R2. Sure. Don't Some make me. Some Dane City boy says he owns this land. Or he's gonna. Okay, so you got the gun. Okay. And how come we live in here? I ain't sure. Confront. How, how I do that? Give money. I ain't giving you money. Get out of here. This land belongs to me now. Ain't nothing on this earth belongs to no one, partner. Looks like you made your decision there, partner. Pop your head out. You're still alive, sir? Hold on, hold on. What type of health? What type of health? What? Bro, this is going on. Jeez. Nigga blew off my head. This is going on a little, little, this is going on a little too long. I was just, yeah, lean back. I was trying to just do some cool shit. That turned into a whole, I lost my damn boom, blew my head off. You ain't gonna pick up your head, John? He said, all right, I'll come back to get it. It's my house now, so. All right. I don't know what this game is now, so. Oh my, dude, you were in the. I'm I'm done talking to you, bro. I'm done talking to you. Ah, it's you, the man with two names and no past. Come on in. How'd you make out? Well, let's just say there are no more squatters. Okay. Well, I got your paperwork ready. Why do I not you trust sure him? About buying this place, it's really run down, and the price isn't too great. I think it would mean a lot for my wife. At least mean I was listening to her. Okay. Well, sign here and here. Well, I hope things work out for him, man. Mm -hmm. Bro just want to live a, a better life. That's all. John, like, okay, what is this? Now we own you, Mr. Marston, and we own Mr. Milton, too, and we own your property. But you can buy your freedom each week. Eventually, you will be a homeowner. That's a horrible way to put it, but thanks, I guess. I understand. Congratulations. Imagine somebody opening up with that. Yeah, we own you now. I beg your pardon. And owned by the bank. <laughs> I'm joking. They own me. But they just own your property. Now, you can also use this line of credit for any home improvements you need to make, of course. I can. Sure. Yep. Be good, Mr. Marsh. It's gonna cost more, though. Of course. Ownership. It's a beautiful thing. Let your wife know what to complain about. <laughs> Just joking. I don't like you. My man's just trying to do a good thing. I really hope it just ends well for him. Well, it is you. Well, oh I never. God, bro. I thought you were how is your drunk ass even alive still, sir? No, more people are needed. No, just let it be Sadie. Can y'all leave him alone? Leave him alone. I don't want this man past, ca bro. <sighs> Dead. Uncle? The very same. Come here. <laughs> I saw you going into the I know bank. he means well, but I just, you know. You ain't robbed it. I've gone straight. Oh, bull crap. No. See? For real. <sighs> well, I'm trying. All these years, you ain't changed a bit. Maybe a little bit. I thought you was dead. <laughs> not yet. Well, I got some things to take care no, of. No, not a problem. I'll come too. No. No, you don't have to. Oh, I'm real sick, John. 
Lumbago. It's uh, slow and. Didn't he lie about being sick like, like so? Lumbago. Lower back pain. Nigga, ain't nothing wrong with you. Do a couple of stretches, bitch. Death, my brother. Evidently. <laughs> Have a little pity, will you? Huh? Come on, then. All right. <laughs> well, now leave him alone. Now, where west are we headed, you damn brother? This ranch I... A ranch I bought just now. Is that what you were doing in the bank? I feel like we shouldn't have even told him that. See, not that that's any of your concern. That's why, like, bro, when time comes and you didn't leveled up in life and you didn't changed, you gotta leave them people from your past alone, bro. You see them out, ignore them. Don't, cause it's just gonna open up old wounds or like, like, bro, just don't talk to them. Don't associate with them. It's not worth it. You bring in past people into your current lifestyle. They gonna mess together and they're not gonna mesh well. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Now we can. What do you think? Why exactly did you buy this dump for Abigail? Why is she an idiot? No. Bro, can you, you leave? Think? I don't know. She said she wanted it. She ever seen it? What are we gonna farm here? <laughs> Rocks? We? You don't have a hope here without a wise hand at the till. Enough of that. Get out of here. On your way. No, you're stuck with me. Seems I'm stuck with you. John, the rock farmer. <laughs> so, you think I'm an idiot? No, I know you're an idiot. Of course, it's a big ass just gonna lay there. I respect the hell out of John. Trying to make his wife happy, just build, you know, rebuilding this place a little bit. Hello? Uh, epilogue part two. Epilogue part two. Beat yourself. Bro, how many parts we got? <laughs> no, in this game, there's like six parts. Please don't be six parts. There you go, your big fat ass. Oh. Working hard? Really? Like. It's the lumbago. Now, if I overdo it, I I'll get a relay. Shut the fuck Get up or get out. You can be so testy. What is it? Constipation? Guess you're my proof I'll never quite outrun my sins. You got so sanctimonious in your old age. No wonder she left you. It's like. He could have got murked and I wouldn't care. He's the only character that could have got murked. Get up! Ow! I'm getting up. Oh, no, wait, what did I have to tell you? I went into town and oh, I, got, I got a little drunk. And who did you see? Oh, shit! Well, we got to go. We got to go to San Denis. For what? Charles. Charles Smith is alive, I Charles? reckon. Charles? Charles Smith alive? Really? I, I reckon. Our child? Yes, I, I don't remember his last point. name, so. By the sound of it, not doing too good, neither. I don't like that our past, man. I would have just went to a whole different city and got some work there, bro, than, than coming back here and getting work. So glad we took a train, ah, bro. Here we are. Come on, let's get off. All right. <sighs> back in San Denis. I never liked this place. Me neither, to be honest with you. Well, me neither. All right, let's go find that big sour bastard. Sure. Let's split up. Good idea. I'll take the saloons, you take the slum. Now, uh, how about I take the saloons and you take the slums? Hey, because your ass is going to go there and drink. What took you so long? Oh, good lord. I was just beginning to enjoy some peace and quiet. <sighs> Asked that first barman I met. And he told me Charles was here. A surprise, <laughs> but not one of life's great massacre. mysteries. And Turns you are out. a killer. We both know what you gotta do. What the hell? I'm leaving now. Charles? He don't know the half of it. John? You're, you're. I'm alive. <laughs> so are you. First of all, so holy see, shit, you're swollen as hell. What are you doing? I don't know. I'm alive. Uncle thought maybe he was in some sort of trouble. Uh, kind of, just... I don't know. What is going I, on, bro? I'm throwing fights for a few dollars. Throwing oh, fights? so you just sure. fighting. And 
You like that? No. Of course not. So, so, let me go place a bet. Come on. Man, I thought you were dead. Sure. Bro, this thing could be- Abigail's still alive too, only she left me. Uh, excuse me, I'd like to place a bet. On who? On myself, to win. Lone Wolf. How much? All of this. Okay. Funny thing, I pegged you for the favorite. You what me? What about you, sir? A uh, little wager on the wolf here? Real redskin brave. Bet on. Sure, I'm a fan of the wolf. You better not lose, bro. How much you betting, bro? You, How much you just gave him? Between the descendant of ancient warriors and a not so noble savage. Bro, I can't see, bitch. On my left. A ferocious battle from the valleys, Simon of Wales, and on my right, an Indian Hercules. Savage, an Indian Hercules. I mean, nigga, he's big, bro. The unbeaten, and dare I say, unbeatable lone wolf. Oh Lord, the you fact that you called him unbeatable. No weapons, no I'm about to no lose money. Like a beaten child, everything else goes. You win by knockout. You win by retirement. Or you win by death. Let's have a good fight, boys. Let's keep it clean, but not so clean. Fight. Bro, Charles. 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 There you go, Charles. There you go. There you go, Charles. Come on, come on. Keep going, keep going at him. Keep going at him. Bro, why are you certain? There you go. Wink. Come on, come on, I'm betting on you, bruh. I don't gamble, but damn it. Damn, Charles! That's it. That's it. He won. Give me my money. Come on, Lone Wolf. Better get you the hell out of here. Hey, Lone Wolf, whoa. How? Made my months, but you also made some fellas mighty unhappy. Oh, of course. So it goes. Here's your share, partner. Appreciate you. Let's go. If we just made the bed, I said we So you keen on staying around here or heading off with me and Uncle? But, John, I haven't seen you two in years. I know. But right now, my sense is you just need to lie low. Where? We got a little place up past Blackwater in the high country. Okay. Oh, I hate this. So, like, the ranch that we're buying is, is starting to is going to start to become our little, like, camp again instead of a home. I hope hey, that I'm wrong, but... I gotta grab my baggage. I booked a steamer heading up river. That's why I was pretending to throw the fight. Okay, boys. I'll meet you at the bridge outside Saint Denis. What are you doing? Oh, just have a few urns to run. <laughs> You're useless. I... I don't trust this nigga, bro. I am a deep thinker. Be quick. Come on. I don't trust this nigga, bro. Let's go. I mean, $40. This okay, way. cool, cool, cool. Uh, my bag's on the dock side. So, what happened? You mean back then? Arthur helped me get out. The legend. Gave me a chance to live, I guess. You you know that Arthur... Sure. Word got to me up north, so I went back and buried him in Miss Grimshaw. Oh, so he I is dead. If any of us had been found, we'd have... Oh, of course. I understand. You Charles, you're a real one for going be. back. Pretty hillside, facing the evening sun. He gave me his satchel and some of his things in it. Remember that journal he always drew in? Yeah, that he was I got Picasso it. in? I'm a bit of a draftsman myself nowadays. He was a good man. Amazing man. As much as any of us could be. Getting sick like that has to rattle a fella. Rattle him or give him some kind of understanding. Mm. What his life was really all about. Yeah. That makes sense. <sighs> anyway. I heard all of you were dead. Or I might have come looking. And me, the same about you. Dutch? Who knows? Who gives a fuck? Dead? Maybe. I'm not sure. I don't care. I heard all kinds of things. I feel like they're gonna pop up, though. One thing I know, he ain't around here. I ain't heard nothing real in years since, well, that time. Bro, so did like. You know I mean? Micah? I hope that bastard's dead. He's not. You know, he was the one speaking to them agents. What? Put Are you just finding out? Time. 
Or since before I got off Sisica. Yep. They picked up Strauss, the agents. Made a real mess of him. I heard he died in custody. Damn. Never said a word. Real nigga. Guess some folk is strong in ways you can't I'm sorry. See. I mean, uh, everything that I'm sorry we kicked you out, but damn, you know. Death. And my mother's calling. Hey, mommy. Micah? None of us is innocent in that. Dutch, least of all. But I don't think we would have. It's only a short walk. What happened? Come oh, on. what the? Why am I stuck? What the hell was hey, that? Don't barge me. So you were saying? But I don't think we would have had to make those calls. Mm. All that mayhem. If it wasn't for... Okay. Uh, hold on. Look, 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 look. Careful. Why? Yep, I see him on the right. Those are Guido Martelli's men. Who? He... I knew uh, big, big head. He used to work for Angelo Bronte. Oh, shit. Well, it's been here an hour. Hey. Uh, Come over here. Bro, we ain't got no guns on us, bro. Well, you go left. I go right. Three. Mm -hmm. Three. Oh, I do have a gun. I. You couldn't have thrown that fight. It's not the job. Let's go. There's a wagon up there. I'll get my bag. Okay. Hurry up. I thought I didn't have a wit. Uh, uh, a gat. Let's get you out of here, bro. Come on, John. Where are we going? I'll try. Oh, oh, bless you, bro. Bless you. I ain't got my rifle though. Damn. Okay. Where was Uncle gonna meet us? Over the bridge going out of town. You see any law? Not yet. Oh, you right. just jinxed it, nigga. Sending me ain't short on police. I remember that. Only too well. Anyone? Good so far. Bro, what is Uncle what doing, bro? Those gunshots, better chance we have. Ma'am, I'm gonna need you to get out of the way. At least. No, we can't get caught. Martelli has the police chief in his pocket. Mm. If they take us in, we won't get out of the interview room. I don't want to get a shootout over this. That's not the man I try to be anymore. Yeah. No, I don't want that either. You see anything? No, not yet. That's weird. We kind of just avoided. I think we're clear. If I ever want to go back, remind me that I hate San Denis. Guido Martelli will happily remind you of that. Give me some simple folk and wide open spaces. I hear that. Speaking of simple. John Charles. <laughs> Why is he just waiting here? You boys been Bro. getting up to no Let me make sure my shit is reloaded. Come on, let's head for home. <laughs> dude, he's dude. What did you do to my house, bro? Who you got at my house? Either that or the voice actor made it did them lines very sus, bro. I've had enough. I had. I've had enough of snakes and rats and betrayals, bro. Can we just like? Why I couldn't have just had to have have a happy ending cutscene? Like, you couldn't have just had John and his girl like living happy ever laughter, Sadie doing her thing. You know what I'm saying? Oh my goodness, I need, bro. Ah, uh, feels like old times. I don't want it to feel like old times. <laughs> Good to have the old gang back together. I don't want to be back Let's together. Just hope things don't turn out like last time. Here he goes. What I tell you, Charles? Boy is as sour as weak old milk. No wonder she didn't stay with you. Not even a retired two dollar whore would stay with you. That's the goddamn truth. Bro, can you now, get you shot? Like, can you go company. away? All he does is whine, whine, whine. Excuse me. Oh, don't get all like, bro, you at my house. Don't change nothing. You're hopeless, and I mean that literally. You got no hope. I mean, look at you. Look at this place. Your dream home. I've had better nightmares than this dream. Oh, darling Abigail, I've changed. Come live with me in an outhouse. I wouldn't ask my worst enemy to take a shit in. What are you trying to say? It's awful. It's a dump. The house has got to go. Get some self-respect, you miserable sack of shit. Build a house a lady set foot in. The place just needs a woman's touch. It needs leveling. I can kind of no agree with woman that. You would know, touch this place. I would, I would build, now, I would build the house. I reckon house. these horses can have it down in a minute. Here, come on. Tie that end around the horses. You loop that end around there. Horses will pull it clean down. <laughs> wow, so really gonna build it from... You good? I think so. All right. Well, <laughs> okay. let's get going. I'm cool with him. Now, he just, he was just talking cool. crazy, you know? You got this, John? I'll go when you do. Bro, 
You don't even need my help with your big swole ass. Larry Wheels ass, bro. Deadlift 920. Like. See? I told you it wouldn't be no trouble. And now? Now we head into town, buy ourselves a house, right out of a book. Same as if it were a bicycle. No, let's. We're in town. What? There's a fella by the train store. Cakes hardwood and timber. Okay. You keep working here. But if I don't go with you, who's going to tell you that? Just need a bit of peace and quiet from your incessant yapping. Charles, make him work. Whip him if you have to. Okay. So are we getting... How about he? I was like, he wanted us to tear down the house and then buy a new one. But I think he just wants to yeah, build it. Yeah. Sadie, I'm coming, my love. And I don't mean that way, unless you want what? Hey, What's up, baby? Oh, John. Just chilling with her Let's piece. Sit down. Sure. Bro, she's you, so uh, hot. Oh my gosh, the way she's just work? chilling like a yeah. like a I mean, badass. Always work. Whole country's getting robbed, robbing or stopping robbers. Well, seems like there ain't much else in this world except bastards, victims of bastards, and the bastards who want to put the bastards in the ground. That would be us. And which are you exactly? The last Me? one. In my time, all three. But True. same as most people. I guess. Funny thing about this job, well, opportunity, I just might get to be all three again. How you mean? Yeah, really. <clears throat> you ever heard of uh, what you eating? Shane Finley? No. Cattle wrestler? Murderer, thief, child killer. Oh, He's hell no. In five states. Oh, yeah, he about to be wanted by the Lord now. Guys, does a lady in a house for fallen women. <laughs> I was bringing him in, and I got robbed by a professional rival of mine, James Langton. Oh, he's a nasty bastard. I didn't much like him even before he robbed me. That happened a lot. This line of work. Mm. Yeah, but they're all people like me. Anyway, now they're holed up in the desert down south, waiting to head north. So you know what I feel like is going to happen? I feel like John... I don't feel like John is going to die. I feel like John is just going to stay in this line of work because it just keeps following him. But he's going you know, to build that house for you know, Abigail and his, and his son and give him some money. And then, you know, he kind of just going to separate himself from them so they can live a better life type thing, which breaks my heart. But I feel like that's what's going to happen. Like, and hand them in to the state troopers in the North Country. I'd given up on the job as just a bad lot. But now that you're here, maybe we can go rob them back. Is the money good? Yeah, it's real good. Plus... I don't much like getting robbed mm. by no one. Come on. Where is it? We're heading again, you say? I need some drip, bro. South. Can now I? Come on, mount up. We got a ride ahead of us. I need some drip, bro. I ain't got no drip. Damn it, man. I'm looking should. raggedy. I just got that red. Oh, this is not my horse. I just got that red drip from goddamn Arthur, bro. There we go. That's something better. I mean, you know. Get my hat. There we go. That new horse. Some folk buy ranches, some buy horses. Horses are cheap. Why that horse look diseased? That horse look like an infected from ah, Last of Us. It's good country. Hmm. All country is good. It's just folk that are bad. True. You know who I got up there with me? Uncle. Besides Uncle. Abigail. Uh, Abigail ain't come there just yet. Really? You er want to talk about it? Well, Maybe, but Charles Smith. We found Charles Smith. Charles? He's alive? Yeah. He's doing okay. He was prize fighting in San Denis. Weren't seeming too well. He took everything real hard. But I think life on the plains is going to be good for him. Mm. I always like Charles. You send him my best. I will. You know, you can come along, too. You see how she always, you see how she like the chocolate? I'm gonna just stop. I'm about to say, you know, you see how she like the chocolate? Oh, I've done that all before. Can't do it again. I'm on my own now, John. I, I ain't so good with people. Mm. Uh, the offer's there. Whenever you want. I love her. That's kind. 
Unlikely to be taken up, but kind. Arthur John you Sadie. Three done? best. Nothing. You? No. You'd think. No, he probably He's got a plan. plan. The Dutch who put a blanket around me after the O'Driscolls? That weren't the same man at Beaver Hollow. Nope, not even close. And now, he might not be so colorful no more. We're going to see both of them, you Mike see and a man Dutch. Whose character changed. I see a man who got found out for who he truly was. Oh. We was fools to follow him. I was a fool and I paid for it. And I was one of the lucky ones. Micah, John. Micah's the one who said it all. Yep. I blame me for following Dutch for too long, but I blame Micah for most everything else. He's out there. And someday, it's gonna be both of us taking I him hope down, we'll bro. Find him. But not now. It's gonna be both of us against him. I know it. He nah oh, man. Knowing him, he probably got his own gang or something. And like all the money bags that we got off the train. If if Dutch got him, like he probably would have brought him went to Tahiti. Like unless they unless uh the people, the police or whatever that was shooting at him, they just didn't have time to pick up the money. So James Plankton, the bounty hunter, has got this outlaw you captured in a women's boarding house? Shane Finley, correct. And we aim to have Langton give him back to us before he rides north with him to hand him over to some state troopers? Correct again. Though the giving back part is optimistic. Yeah. I'm forever the optimist. That's good. It's a good trait, you know. You know, I've been doing some bounty hunting of my own since I last saw you. Yeah, I just took down I his... I gonna make a habit Yeah. Of it. Yeah. We cut off here. Oh my gosh, this view is amazing. This is the place. It's a view, all right. Right? Like, I'm so glad you understand, bro. Yup. There they are. Down there. Who's who? Well, the bounty is the feller who's all tied up. Of course. Very funny. And that big fat feller with the funny hat? That's James Langton. The other fellas just work for him. Where do you think they're heading? I don't know. Come on. Let's go follow him. So we just gonna snipe him and be done with it? Like wrong. Bro, matter of fact, where's your Oh, I guess I guess when he talked to Gettys, that's when he quit. Cause I was about to say, like, bro, are you not just gonna work for the other dude no more? What are you doing, huh? You talking to me or like to Sorry. I ain't used to having anyone with me. Hmm. I feel like I feel like the majority of people talk to themselves My to a degree. they'll stop up ahead. We can get a better look at them. You know his thinking pretty well. Huh? If you can't outgun them, you gotta outthink them. Ugh. Yeah, they're stopping. And that sure is Shane Finley coming off the back of his horse. What are they waiting for? Uh, the rest of Langton's men, I think. <laughs> Langton's doing pretty well for himself. Right. How come he's got all them men and you work alone? I got you. You're worth ten of them. Oh, great. All right, so what you think? Should we threaten them? Start shooting at them or sneak down and pick them off one by one? I reckon sneaking down is our best opportunity, but uh, it's your call. I'm with you, baby. Like, I'm, I'm with you. I didn't mean to... I pressed the wrong sh... Reckon you threaten them and I'll cover you. Okay. Get over there and I didn't. Cover I didn't mean that. They gave that's the first time they gave me three options, bro. Hey, James Langton, Where they at? You me. Oh that Lord. Give it back to me or I'll murder every last one of you. I'm gonna give you ten seconds to walk away. Ten, nine, eight, seven. <laughs> God damn, hold on. Bro, can I not get hit marked right now? Why is there a fly? Can you move? I'm in the middle of something yet. Bro, I'm... Thank you. That was terrible, but... Oh 
Oh my, bro, I ain't got time. What is happening? Run! God damn, where are they even at? Down there? Somebody to the right. Of course I miss. Thank you. Are you kidding? Oh my gosh, I wish we would have snuck in. God damn. Can I get behind you, baby? Hold on. I'm missing all of these damn shots right now. Hold on. Hold on. Golly. Like. Made a mistake. The one time I wish I went stealthy. Move. Is he? Where is he? Move. Like. Move. Move. Bro, I'm parkouring this shit right now. Bro, oh my, bro. I can't see. I guess I don't need to see. We need our horses. I know that. Hold on. Look at him here, dead. I told you I'd kill every last one of you, Langton. All right. See, with her, that damn heart. What's it look like? Let's get Finley. Get him out of here. Okay, you're taking Finley. Let's go. I got him, baby. Let's go, let's go, let's go. It didn't work out for you before, woman. You should let me alone. Now, can you? Let's drive. There's more. Oh, Lord. Oh, the <laughs> She's so fine. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, my. Ugh. Bro, my God was falling. Hold on. I'm missing. Hold on. Oh. I can't. <laughs> just go, just go, just go. Come on, baby. The the Am I dual wielding? Oh my, that's why I'm hitting all my shots. I'm dual wielding. Oh my goodness. Y'all in the comments, tell me how uh, long the epilogue is, for real. Like, how many parts are there? Is it just two parts or three parts? Or somebody, oh bro, there's eight parts. Bro, there better not be no damn eight parts. <laughs> better not be no eight parts. Better not be five parts. I need to relieve myself. There'll be a bucket in your cell. I'm serious. Yeah. You can kill yourself. So Hit him, John, please. Hey, you don't need to do that just because she told you to. Oh, that's my I don't baby. Need to be hit. I just want to be treated civil. Shut it. No, that's my baby. You Shut heard up. Me. Thank yeah. you. I still protest my innocence. This woman ripped me. Can somebody? I I really don't like asking for artwork. I really don't. But can somebody draw me? <laughs> somebody, somebody draw me with my baby. You know what I'm saying? I got the cowboy fit on, and I'm just with my. <laughs> I wish I knew how to draw, bro. I wish I knew how to draw. I would have been drew it, bro. John would you be so kind as to shut him up? Yes, ma'am. Don't listen to her. No, I listen to my wife. Let me speak my piece. No. There's no call to hit me, mister. Listen to him squirm. Jesus. Speak Bad to this fist, bitch. County work ain't easy, John. No. But I can see now it has its rewards. That's a whole lot easier with a partner. Mm. That back there, you didn't need a partner. You needed a whole company behind you. We did fine. And with Langton and his men gone, there'll be more demand for our service. <laughs> so this is how we're going to make money. You know I'm a rancher now. I don't think you're Mostly. a rancher anymore, bro. And I know how you're paying for your ranch. Yeah, see, she don't gets it already. Hi, I won't. But here we are. 
Grab him. Sure. You're a bitch and a bastard. Okay. I should have slapped you again. Don't ever talk to my lady like that. Bitch. We brought in Shane Finley. Oh, look how she walked. Hey. <laughs> Put him in the cell. I'm object to this. Yeah, pop your head on the bed. We're gonna watch you swing. What Ooh. for? I didn't do anything. Nothing. Yeah, yeah. I thought you said you lost him. Well, I did, but we got him back. Oh, and James Langton's dead. We killed him. Why'd you do a thing like that? It was him that robbed me. Okay. Here. Why does it feel sus? Everything feels There's sus in this game, bro. On Finley. Mm hmm. I know. <laughs> See you later, uh. sir. You want this money to go to the bank, too? No, I'll, uh, I'll take it myself. <laughs> okay, Jim Milton. Bro. It's John Marston here. All right, well. I mean, me, don't mean me a country girl, man. <laughs> bro, why she got a chokehold on me like this, bro? I don't think I've ever had a girl, a game character, have a chokehold on me. On. Yeah. Yeah, no. You know, lady from DMC5, you know, she bad. Sindel from Mordecai, yeah, she bad, bad. But, like, it's something about Sadie that just... If you need any more work, you can find me in town. Well, I'm gonna find or you. Maybe I'll find you. I'm retired. No, you're not. Sure. <laughs> Be well, John. Uh. Ooh! Nice to hundo? Oh.